that is the version the MIUI 23.1.9 14 MIUI 14 version you can see here it was version 1 or anything like that but we got v3 version i will show you the version as you can see i copied it to downloads in the internal memory itself as you can see this is the v3 version and i will be disabling these uh, passwords like it's not required also but anyhow let's do it i am uh, dirty flashing for the first time this rom particularly and will boot into recovery let's power off this smartphone and press the volume up button and power button simultaneously in order to boot into recovery there was an advanced restart button also i didn't found out and here we go you will be i mean it will be booted into orange fox recovery here i am using if you want to use twrp also you can use it out but orange fox is convenient for me for most of the roms and you can see here it's booted into orange fox recovery here once that has been booted directly go to downloads here wherever you downloaded the file as you can see version 3 and 13 23.01.09 v3 just flash it As you can see the ROM zip file has been flashed successfully now just go to home section here or directly you can reboot system here also but go to home and select reboot and select the system that's how simple it is let's see whether it will boot into the updated v3 version or not as you can see it's booted finally i am happy here hope you guys are so happy let me know in the comment section if you are then like a video and here we go the first notice the thing here this weather application has been getting uh, crash here and this is the version okay now uh, let's begin this video let's see what all the things has been updated and how is the benchmark results and everything let's see in this video hey hi hello welcome back to my new video this is sampath you're watching sampath samfix youtube channel and this is me 11x you can see here the poco f3 or redmi k40 and i have flashed this using dirty flash method for the first time and i experienced a little bit of problems you already seen while after flashing and starting the smartphone i mean rebooting into smartphone you will notice that weather application crash you will get report here I simply disabled that I tried using clearing data it won't happened again but uh, still I disabled the weather application and one more thing you will notice once you boot into the ROM I mean the updated v3 version you will notice that text on the icons has been gone even in the home screen and even in the app drawer I tried to I mean I didn't done the clear all data for uh, launcher because we know the launcher has problems in the previous versions again if I get the same I need to reflash everything hence I didn't made like that I tried to find out where there is any options here like for example if I go into home screen I tried to found out this uh, dock here and the animations were very cool here as you can see this dock I found out but I didn't find the what i said that one let me go into home screen as you can see regarding that let me go into like light mode here yeah the toggles are fine here as you can see those things are fine you will notice some flickering here okay now it's fine okay coming back here i was saying like don't show text is there but it should have text at least for widgets and all that's the option but i was finding for the app drawer and re the home screen but i did not found anything even in the recents you can see here hide app name has been given here but it's turned off icon centered as you can see nothing here even regarding this like i found this one number of columns per folder and right above this i found something like in the icons i guess yes yeah dock bar you can enable or disable from your shadow reflection and reflection here i 
found is there any text options here dock bar as i said you will get crawl and stock as you can see it's a little bit different now you can keep it out and there is no regarding test i did not found that maybe it's a bug if i am wrong correct it is there any options in the settings i did not found out within a given period of time i mean the rom released around what time let's check as you can see it was released around what time actually i couldn't find okay 6 50 pm now it's happening like 8 30 at this time i can't found out really i don't think so is there any option and the version is like for this is like china based the previous one for that this is not the update the update for this weekly china build you can see me vn this is not a vn a edition as you can see this is a vn a edition for that also you can check out my video and this is for like 14.0.23.19 same version just the version is third year that's the difference actually i did not found any major changes or anything like that i run the cpu throttling test here you guys can see it was horrible i don't know what was the problem this is the first time i am doing dirty flush in any smartphones in custom roms especially you can see the maximum is 287 and average is 221 and minimum is 158 million jps which is good but this was i was surprised i getting this code but i don't believe in this uh, what the app results i don't believe even the geek pen scores what i got here it was with a balanced mode only i did not try the performance mode here single score is 994 and multi score is 3220 and kernel as i said 4.19.157 is the kernel used here that's the thing here the animations are cool and definitely if i go into this version again you can see updated security they have mentioned you will get under 13 and 2023 one one i mean january security patch and kernel 4.1 and 0.157 that's the thing here uh, i did not found any major changes the ui is getting smooth after a certain period of time you should give some time and the library again this bug hasn't solved super wallpapers as you can see whatever i do it's not going to download this is a bug it was available from long time but anyhow it's a minimal bug we can manually install the wallpapers also and this one i think we should get an update for launcher or what i don't know the text on the icons has been simply missing here that's a big bug i can say because in previous versions it had it and notification control center and everything is fine here i did not found any problem you can see you can't simply believe on this cpu throttling test that was the 100 threat test guys and you can simply don't believe on this benchmark results and all this is a prime example and the best example you can see the ui is really really smooth in my opinion but still in cpu throttling it is showing throttling i don't know why it's showing like that and benchmark results as you can see it also could have been better this multi score but still it's a very good score for this mua vn edition and this option you get it as you can see it's still available you can increase the large tiles and a location like this that's i really i really like this dock on it was previously also present i don't know but when i want to search this text names i got it and horror it's fine again i kept, kept these locks here fingerprint and face unlock let me check it out fingerprint unlock will be fast only as you can see it is very very quick to unlock your smartphone using this and the face unlock let's see yeah it's very quick just see this tap it gets unlocked into your smartphone and let's check this 33 watt charging support and the animation what we get and if you're first time to this channel hit that subscribe button guys and also allow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and if you like the video give it a like i will be making similar kind of videos now on this mi 11x as you can see it is supporting 33 watt charging that is available here the animation is also it's a cool here that's it guys if you have any specific questions regarding this particular rom if you have any doubts comment down feel free to comment i will be answering within a while and if i use it in the performance mode i might get a better scores but i haven't tried it it's like a five percent improvement i can say sometimes it's not going to be that much noticeable also and camera again you can see 
nothing new it's working fine no problem regarding that all these things have been updating here just downloaded previously only and gallery again if i go into more into details you can see nothing more here that's the thing guys this is the mui vn 23.1.0.9 whatever the version is v3 version i can say i don't remember those things that's it guys we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keep smiling bye bye for now